What's up everybody? We just entered into Minnesota. We saw the city of Minneapolis and it was really pretty. The skyline was amazing. Neither of us have actually been here. We're like in the middle of the Midwest, so it's pretty cool. We're no longer surrounded by the Great Lakes and we are like completely landlocked. And we have some exciting news that I am very hyped about. Yeah, we don't even know what to do with ourselves right now. Literally. Um. So basically what happened was, like the first week that we set off on this trip, my grandfather emailed me and said that his brother, so my great uncle, wanted to mail us something and could we give like an address? And I was like, yeah, but like I couldn't give him an address because we don't have one and like and we're always was, on the move so it's so hard. Yeah, and it was too late for the Chicago address so we couldn't give him that and we knew after Chicago we really aren't gonna be staying anywhere until like the West Coast, so that was gonna be pretty yeah. odd. Yeah, so I didn't really know what to do, but I was just like, have him call me and like, we'll figure it out. But I started emailing with my great uncle and we were just discussing where he could mail this. Eventually I was like, what are you trying to mail? He literally just replied, spark drone. <laughs> and I was like, no. what? <laughs> so I guess he's just really inspired by like what we're doing and he basically said in his email that he's been wanting to get involved with a drone for a really long time and he after seeing like our videos and some of the stuff like we're doing here we could really be people that could put one to good use. He saw that the new spark drone and how it's like more compact because we had looked into getting a drone before yeah. this trip but it was just like not way too expensive. Way too expensive like, and also crazy. like we didn't know how we would carry it around because they're so big, but he saw that the spark drone came out and it's more compact, but still like quality footage you get mm -hmm. out of it. And so he like saw it fit to get us one and just like gift it to us. And it's so amazing. Like, I don't even know. I know. It's like, crazy. I just, I talked to him on the phone like a couple times and I was just like, I don't even know how to thank you, but we're just going to use the shit out of it, honestly, and get really cool footage from it so we are extremely excited we figured out the way that he can mail it to us because i basically just told him like the route that we'd sort of be on and he was like where where will you be by like next thursday and i was like probably like minnesota so this is minnesota that we are in we're like right outside of minneapolis and he figured out a way to send it to like some post office locker that we go and scan the barcode and pick it up and then we have a drone yes. so <laughs> we are like out of our minds like excited but yeah so we're about to go get that and that's what's happening <laughs> so we're walking up on the cub foods where the Amazon lockers are outside of. So many. Literally, that was it. We're done. Now we're back to the van to open this. Literally, cannot thank him enough. We don't even know what to do with ourselves. Pull it out. Oh my god. Oh my this god. is crazy. This is so wild. <laughs> oh my god, is that its case? Yeah. Instructions. Oh my god. <laughs> wow. Oh my god. That's literally perfect for what we're doing because when we looked into it at first, like, it was just such a safety hazard, like, carrying around a huge drone all the time. So this is, like, incredible. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Look at that little guy. There's a camera. Here's the wings. DJI. This is so insane. This literally fits in the palm of my hand. It's smaller than your face. <laughs> like, literally. This is its charger. So we unboxed it and there's so much instructions that we have to read and we have to figure out how to use it. So that's what we're going to be doing for the next couple of days. And we're so happy that we have it for the Badlands. Just so happy to have it for like any view that we're going to see. Footage from yes. drones is insane and we both love film. And like that's pretty much why my uncle like sent it to us or my grand uncle because he knew that like we would put it to use. And he's like really inspired by what we're doing. And obviously he's my family and like we're just so grateful. 
and we're definitely going to be putting it to good use. So thank you so much to my great uncle David mm -hmm. and his wife Bonnie. I'm so excited to get footage of the van just like driving down a cool road and I want to get it before the leaves are gone off the trees. So we have work to do. We're just so excited and so grateful and thankful that like basically like a dream came true. Like we wanted a drone so bad and now we have one. Yeah, this is like beyond like Chilling. anything like I could have ever expected. I like was like blown, I'm still blown away, but like. We are now going to try and find a field to practice this thing on. <laughs> and we got to figure out where we're sleeping tonight. So we will see you in our next videos. Thank you guys so much for watching.